How's it going, gamers? My bow turned up yet? Not yet. I still haven't gone to Iverston, like I told you. I know it's been like, I don't know, like a few days, but it's easy. I'm going to Iverston now. Uh, let's put oak flesh here. Uh, I'm gonna try and pu do punchies. I'm gonna try and do punchies and see how strong they are. Um, I don't know how much damage your unarmed does automatically, but, you know. I can boost my unarmed damage pretty high, especially once I get to the point where I'm able to enchant very, very well. Which, after this recording session, which I'll try to fill out the rest of this week, um, I'm going to do some off-screen grinding to get some things for Jen that he's gonna need. You know? Important, important things. Uh, Book of Love. Oh, no. Todd, please don't punish me like this. Okay, never mind. I thought the game crashed. I thought Todd was punishing me. <laughs> All right. I mean, I'm punching pretty hard. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I'm punching decent. Vandal, come on, dude. Alright. You know, certain parts of Skyrim can be really pretty. Other parts, not so much. But, you know. I'm enjoying this little, uh... This little area. The rift is probably my favorite part of Skyrim. I think that's most people's favorite part of Skyrim, like favorite area. I'm, I'm, yeah, I don't even need sparks really. A small farm. These are very noisy crops. I'm just going to uh, get rid of them. Excuse me, what was that noisy thing? 
We could always use help picking crops if you need a few extra coins. There's a lot of Nern roots. Actually, I'm growing it if you hadn't noticed. I'm oh. the only person alive that can cultivate Nern root from a seed to a fully grown plant. How? I had quite the mentor. He taught me everything he knew about the Nern root and its strange Cinderian. I haven't seen him in many years. I wonder what became of him. Is it that obvious? Are you exhausted? I've got my Tired. hands full here. Between the farm chores, Oof. cultivating my supply of Nernroot, and keeping a tight rein on my sister Adori, there's little time for rest. What do you mean, keeping a tight rein? I get help. Really? That would be a pleasant change. One of the ingredients I need to cultivate Nernroot are Jazz Bay grapes. The acidic content of the juice is perfect for the soil. I oh. need 20 of them for my current crop. Good luck finding those Jazz Bay grapes. They're very rare. Oh. Okay. I, uh... have higher goals. Like, look at that. High Hrothgar is just like a centerpiece. Jin can't. <laughs> oh, Jin can't see it. Holy shit! Holy shit! What the fuck? What the fuck? Calm down. No, no. Stop that. Stop. I need you to 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 stop. Why? Why did you attack me? Did you just wish to die? Why would you do that? That is so rude. So, so rude. Oop, sorry. Uh oh. Maybe we should go around. I can swim, but I, I don't know how you feel about swimming. Do you not like it? Dear, we're on land now. We run, we run, we run. Oh! Man, death. Like, don't fuck with Jin because he legitimately will beat you to death. What the fuck? Are, wait. Are these resurrected chickens? What was this man doing here? I'm so confused. <gasps> what? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where is this man? Where is he? Where is he? Where did he go? I... Come on. Where did he go? Boost! Where's the body? Where's the giant, Mansley? Looking. 
I love the Iron Giant. It's my favorite movie, by the way, in case any of you needed to know. It's just a good movie. I uh, don't have the energy to like go into it right now, but like. Honestly, if you get a chance, watch it. If you haven't. <laughs> oh, Jun's gonna use that. Hold on. Uh, Feindal, I have another quest for you. Wow. Thank you. I've got your back. It's a Lead skill on. book. I don't care. No. For any of y'all who want to read it. Oh, I never noticed that. Like the. Oh, no, that's just my sleeve. Never mind. Damn, this is a fucking long book. <sighs> There's some long books in Skyrim. I feel bad for Do Brian David. Gil I feel bad for Brian David Gilbert. Um. There's this Nord Ruin here. There's another Nord Ruin. There's two very close to each other. Interesting. Let's go. Here we are. Iverstead. You must be one of those wizards from the college in Winterhold. I'm not a wizard, I swear. I punched things really hard. Do wizards do that? I don't think so. I don't think so, do they? No lollygagging. I'm... I'm not. I'm literally jogging. I have work to do. I have work to do. Are you the one sent by Mara? Ah. Uh, how did you know? I prayed to Mara and she spoke to me in a dream. She said a stranger would appear to help me. Is that you? Yes. I didn't. My parents are being impossible. Bassianus wants to marry me. I think I love him, but he wants to move to Riften afterwards, and my father won't allow it. He only cares about this stupid town. But Bassianus makes me happier than anyone ever has. Well, happiness is all that matters. Why is there cheese on the ground? Sorry, I smell the cheese. Uh, you sound. I don't want to cheese. choose. They're both so amazing. That man is toilet. Is that your what? Is that your lunch, bud? My daughter's driving me crazy. So forgive me if I'm a bit on edge. Your daughter asked me I'm to sure speak I to know you. What this is about. She thinks she's in love with Bassianus and wants to leave town. With him. Let me tell you how I see it. Until a few months ago, the girl was head over heels for Clement. Wouldn't stop talking about it. Now, if I thought she was really in love with Bassianus, that would be one thing. But she's a child. It will pass. I... Why do you want her to stay? There's not much left. It used to be a good-sized town. Folks have been moving to Riften for a while now. If all the young people leave, what happens to Ivor? I... I don't know. This is too hard for me to think about. Listen, I grew up in a fucking... <laughs> you know how it 
Her fancies change with the mood. And like always, the boy lacks any kind of spine. He needs some convincing. A little push, and this would all be simple. Uh, well, Volamir, could you tell me anything about Hyrothic? Why is everybody wearing... Why is everybody wearing Tot? They call it the path to the monastery to 7,000 steps. Can you imagine? I'm not certain if I could even make it to the top without collapsing from exhaustion. Ha! Is that a challenge? Jean never backs down from a Get out of town true as fast challenge. As you can. Nothing for anyone here. <laughs> we don't talk about that. Wait, where's the? Oh, I have to talk to her. If those white run gods can take down the dragon, so can we. You must be another pilgrim on the way up to High Hrothgar. No other reason to pass through here. Uh, actually, yes, but also I'm oh here my. about your daughter. Probably something about the men. We all wish we had our problems. I don't tell my <laughs> husband, but I don't have any problem with Bassianus. Even if it means her leaving Iverstead, I want Fastred to be happy. If they just snuck out of town together, I could manage my husband. Uh. <laughs> Bassianus is still so terrified of Yoththor. If he knew that I'd keep him from hunting the poor boy down, he'd take Fastred to Riften without a second thought. Well, then. Let him know that I'll watch out for them. Just want my daughter to be happy. There we go. Easier. It's frightening living below their monastery. Sometimes I swear I can hear strange noises rolling down from up there. It sounds it's like thunder. Yep. There's never any way. I mean, I can do that. What do you make of that? I mean, it's probably sure, some. Please. Everyone else. Calm the fuck down. Hey, it's probably something similar to that. Uh, you ever settle down to have children? Think twice before you do it. I adopted. On your way up the seven thousand steps again, Clement? Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Rothgar. The path isn't safe. Aren't the Greybeards expecting some supplies? Mm. Honestly, I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. Hello. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? About to make a delivery up there myself. Oh. This is when not the to 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 stop. Supplies, that guess. shouting is making people nervous. Sorry. Good. Glad we straightened that out. 7,000. I've been to the monastery what can you many tell times, me but I've never even laid eyes on one of the Greybeards. Not that I'd care to. Being Rude? masters of Methul, they could kill you by uttering a single word. Yeah, but well, they would. Not that they would. They seem <laughs> peaceful, but I wouldn't want to provoke them. Why would you provoke them? Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Dude, those guys gotta drink a lot of water. Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. Well, I can do it. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Yeah. Here. I'm going up there anyway. Take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Of course. What should I watch well, out for? Well, there's the occasional wolf pack or stray, but that's all I've ever had to deal with. Shouldn't be a problem for the likes of you. Other than oh, that, watch your foot. Not. In these wintry conditions, the stairs can be treacherous. Be careful up there. I mean, doesn't seem that wintry to me, but whatever. Uh. Wait, hold on. Climax the other guy. I need to talk to Bassianus. Bassianus this way. I think Bassianus is this way.
see, here's the thing. Seems like the dad's trying to force her to marry the older guy, which I think is a little creepy. Like, just let her marry whoever she wants. Oh, hello. Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. You don't look like this a has to be the worst place in Skyrim to run a mill. How am I supposed to do anything with all those bears running around? You have a bad problem. Those damn things will drive me right out of business. Well, I will tell you what. Bring me ten of their pelts from anywhere in Skyrim. I'll gladly pay you for thinning out the herd. From anywhere. Now go give those stupid bears what's coming to them. Yes. Anything you can tell Clinic me about brings the food supplies God. up to them once every few weeks, when the weather permits it. Other than that, they seem like a quiet lot. Don't really know too much about them. This man's an Imperial. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Klimic. Oh. I think he doesn't want him to marry her, or her to marry him because this guy's an Imperial. How I long to take her away from all of this. Why did Bodhi yes. send you to me? She's. She said you should have left. had a feeling. <laughs> more than that brute Yothor. She said you should just leave. Yothor. What about him? He'll come after us, and it will be unpleasant. She would. She. If it's she her husband. She can handle him. Everything would be all right. Yes. I'll. I'll go speak to Thastrid, post haste. I wish I could make my deliveries more often, but the road's getting dangerous. Sorry I just cucked you, Klimic. <laughs> God damn, sorry, fa bad fade doll. You and Bassianus are like... <laughs> Jin's fucking primary export is helping dudes cuck other dudes. <laughs> Never. Oh. Fastrid, we must speak. Bassianus, sweetie, what is it? We must leave. Your father will never approve of us, and I grow weary of this place. There we Where go. Where will we go? To Rift in my pet. How you'll adore the city. Oh, and to be with you. I'll make the preparations immediately. You know, I don't like the way that he said my pet, but also they're probably just into some kinky shit. <laughs> Alright. I will return to her. Once again. I smell bear upon the wind. And... Blood. What is this? There's a cave here. Let us go. Tam. Tembo wide arms. Dude, I'm probably gonna get all these fucking bear pelts here. How many. Okay, how many. How many people do you think she said? Sorry, that just scared me. How many people do you think she's sent to, um... To do this? It's gotta be a lot, right? Anyways, that's not our problem right now. Right now. I mean, good thing I killed that thing right there, because that's just, like, here, but, um... Oh, Jin's gonna need his walking stick. Well, no. Uh... People have counted these. It's actually 7,000 steps. So, um... Uh... 
it seen uh, it's got a it's etched man it's got braille underneath it the you know before the birth of men dragons ruled all of mundus their word was the voice they spoke only for the tr only for true needs the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land all right I'm just gonna say there's braille underneath those plaques There we go. Pretty sure Feind all got the killing blow on that, but... In these seven thousand steps up to high rock, la 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 la. Can I hold on? No, it's not an RP walk. That's way too slow. <laughs> an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. Did you hear them shout Dovahkiin? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. What are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Do you visit them? They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Ah, you're too Some scared. Some who make the trip leave them food or other essentials. But not to make conversation. Yeah. I... Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men were weak then. Had no voice. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I got some strong fists, boy. Please come back, come back. We see chasing go. Travel further up. There's emblem number three. our own offering. <gasps> shit, shit. Ah, fuck. Ah, God. No. Bye. Killer. 
Get her ass! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Forgive me. Put that back. That's where it belongs. There we go. See? I did not mean to do that. I'm going to uh, drop one of these. Put it here. Yes. Okay, we're done. The fledgling spirits of men were strong in the old times. Unafraid to war with dragons and their voices. But the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. Hold on a sec. All right, I'm back. Where's Fane now? Fane doll, the the god of the wood elves. Uh, I forget his name. Or her name, I think, actually. Uh, she's basically... Kin yeah, no, it's her name. She's basically Kinnereth, right? So, like... Well, she's your equivalent to Kinnereth, right? So... This must be interesting for you. You know? Getting to go up. To see some priests of Kinnereth. Some of the most esteemed priests of Kinnereth. Karita? Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Rothgar. Did you hear them shout? I was just outside Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. Who are you? Just a pilgrim. I'd prefer to leave it at that, if you don't mind. Okay. What are you Walking doing? Walking the steps. Meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Nice. All right, then. Kine called on Parthrax, who pitied man. Together they taught men to use the voice. Then the dragon war raged, dragon against tongue. Sounds like Drakengard. Only sexier. <laughs> I got a few mutuals who if they're watching this they'll get that <laughs> return to monkey Put me here. Okay. This is right where I, like, waited for a little bit. Okay. Sweet. Um. So. How about... Jin, are you okay, bud?
Eesh. That doesn't... <laughs> oh, that hand does not look good. That does not look good. I think I punched the control a little too hard. Um... I couldn't, I couldn't even attack like that. There we go. So, yeah, I couldn't even, like, use my hands. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path. You must be one of those wizards from the college in Winterhold. You look a little different. Okay, round two with this guy. Monkey. Why can't I use... Hold on. What happened? You know, sometimes pain is inevitable. close to him. Oh, it just takes my health down so goddamn fast. I might have to do the one thing I didn't think I would ever do.
There we go. Bam. Dead. Not gonna use a troll pelt. What the fuck? Since when? Is that with Dawn Guard? I got a copyright claim for the get down meme. For the get down meme. Oh, man prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world, proving for all that their voice was too strong, although their sacrifices were many full. Uh, yeah, I got a copyright claim for that. Not a strike, so it doesn't count against my channel. It's just I wouldn't be able to monetize a video, but I don't even think I can monetize videos yet. I don't know. I maybe I'm not sure. I'm not sure how the whole YouTube thing works yet. But um yeah. Continuing up the mountain. With roaring tongues, the sky children conquer. Founding the first empire with sword and voice while dragons withdrew from this world. Like, this is just a really cool, like, kind of way to do things. The tongues at Red Mountain went away humbled. Jurgen Windcaller began his seven-year meditation to understand how strong voices could fail. Oh, yeah, because they went to conquer Red Mountain, but they failed. Uh, damn. Jin's just breathing in the air. That view, for me, like that view, it's beautiful. Let's, um, hold on. Never mind, that's the high farthest I can see. It's nice, it's pretty. Check this one. Emblem eight. Jurgen Wincaller chose silence and return. The seventeen disputants could not shut him down. Jurgen the Calm built his home at the throat of the world. Boy, so strong. Nobody could. Nobody's shouts could even touch him. He was so strong. For years all silent, the Greybeard spoke one name. Tiber Septum, Stripling then, was summoned to High Hrothgar. They blessed and named him Dovaki. We've made it. At the top, the 7,000 steps to the former home of Jurgen Wincaller. Thaindal. I've got your back. I think it's I'll time we part ways. I will meet you back in Riverwood. 
This is a place that only I may go. I should have just... No, no. I needed his help to get up here. Well. With that, gamers, ends this recording session. I will see you all next time on Skyrim when we meet the Greybeards here in High Hrothgar and Jin comes one step closer to achieving his destiny.